One of the perennial issues in reservoir modeling is how much detail do we need to put into the model? And here in the, we're here in Clashite Cove, beautiful June sandstones, and nature's given us a wonderful little experiment here. The weathering here is showing the permeability contrast. And what you can see is that on a millimeter scale, the water flowing through the rock here is picking up permeability heterogeneity. The question is, what do we do with that when it comes to looking at a simulation or modeling grid cell, which is the size of Clashite Cove? Well, we suggest that actually it's something you can just think through logically. We've got a little cheat sheet. There's one on the website. Download it for free. And it really comes down to two things. First up, the thing that we call Flora's rule, is to think, well, is the fluid we're dealing with sensitive to that kind of heterogeneity? And the simple rule of thumb, as Flora would say, is that if it's a gas field, you need three orders of magnitude contrast, perm contrast, to see the heterogeneity. Oil field, two. And only if it's a heavy oil or a field with steam or water injection, then you become sensitive to these one-order contrasts. So first question, is our fluid sensitive to the heterogeneity? The second question, if the answer is yes, is what's the length scale that that heterogeneity is playing out on? So in this case, we have a very, very small scale, small length scale heterogeneity, and we need to compare that with the scale of the development question, which is usually the well spacing. In that scenario, you get into one of these situations where the heterogeneity is so repeatable, it becomes an REV, see the other V blog. On the issue of length scale, it, length scales become important for modeling when the length scale of the heterogeneity is larger. And if we look up here across the dunes, down here we have fine scale wind ripple, but up there, there's another order of magnitude in the core of the dune, an order of magnitude more perm. And that we're sensitive to, but the heterogeneity plays out on tens of meters. There. The length scale is significant compared to the length scale of the question, and those are the things that we need to put in our model.